Carolyn, how do people know if their medicine is expired? Every medication that we buy, whether it's from the pharmacy counter or whether it's in prescription, must have an expiry date on it. So check your expiry dates. If it's out of date, get rid of it. So some of them may be hard to read, I guess, Yes, would they? they would be. Sometimes it's in tiny writing. Sometimes it's actually obscured by the prescription label. And um, other times it's embossed on the end of a cream tube and you wouldn't know to look. Bring it to the pharmacy if you're not sure. We're always here to help. But if you're not sure and you haven't used it for a while, I'd get rid of it anyway. It's probably a sure sign that it's yeah, old. Yeah, it's old, yeah. Why is it harmful to take old medicines? There's a few reasons why you wouldn't take old medicines. If they're expired, they're probably not going to work the way you want them to because they lose their effectiveness. What's worse is with older medicines, sometimes they start decomposing or degrading and the active ingredients may become harmful or even toxic to the system. So a lot of people might think, well, it's only a little bit out of date. Isn't that okay? No, it's not okay. The expiry dates are not an accident. They're a deliberate calculation on how long a medication will be useful. So even if they are just a little bit out of date, we don't want to take the risk. Why is it dangerous to store your unwanted medicines in the home? Unwanted medicines are medicines we're not using anymore. If we're not using them anymore, or if they're expired medicines and we're not using them at all, there's no reason to have them at home. They're a cause of confusion. You could actually be doubling up on current medication because you don't know that they're the same. Different names, generic names. And the third thing is that if you're storing, stockpiling medications in the house, children could get their hands on it. And if you don't have children, perhaps some of your visitors might have children. And I suppose elderly people could get confused too. The older we get, we all get a bit more confused, don't we? <laughs> that's exactly right. And that's why I say it is a source of confusion. And you could be doubling up on your current prescription medication, as opposed to perhaps an older prescription medication that had a different brand name on it. So what are the three things I guess we're asking people to do here? Read your labels, check your expiry date. Remove them from your storage area, your medicine cabinet, put them in a bag and bring them to the pharmacy. Remember, read, remove, return.